I like the Eagles in the NFC right now. I think the Packers have rebounded well as well. Buccaneers, I still have up there. The Rams are sitting at two and one. So those are kind of the four in the NFC that I have circled. I like the Eagles right now best. They've really, really impressed me. I think Jalen Hurts is balling. But yeah, yeah. you like the Bills in the AFC. Is there an NFC team, Ike, that you like best? I'm going to go out. I'm going to go with Philly. Yeah. Tell me why we can't like Philly. Because because it's not Aaron Rodgers and Tom Brady. Philly, Philly looking good. Boy, they got a run game. And, and they, they, they acquired Brown. And Brown looking like he looking like a man amongst boys out there. And then you got Devontae. Devontae feel like he back at Alabama, making the plays he making. Oh, I forgot we got Jalen Hurst too, who can squat down there 600 pounds. Oh, he happened to be our quarterback, by the way, fellas. <laughs> so, and the running game, bro, hey, listen. And the defense ain't bad either. Hey, listen. Sleep on Philly if you want to. Sleep on Philly. Sleep on Philly if you want to. It's it's definitely it's definitely gonna be an issue. So yeah, I, I, I like I like Philly. At the Philly, at the Philly, I still I still roll with Tom. Because yeah. you never out the game with Tom, and he had his two starters out the game. Mike out the game, and uh, Godwin was out the game. And so, defensively, Akeem Hicks too, and they still only gave up fourteen points. Correct. So, so please, please, a hey, Tom always find a way though. So. You know, I, I like Philly right now, though, Mark. Mark, I like Philly. I think it's all covered together in Philly. Then after Philly, I go with uh, Tom and Cup. Yeah, they had a moment in last week's Monday night game against the Vikings, Ike, where you always mention when a quarterback can run, it forces a defense to remain honest, and you can play 11 on 11 offensively. And he had a one on one where it's a read option play, and it's him in the safety you know, battling it out into the end zone. And it's just like, it really kind of opened up my mind of what the possibilities are at the quarterback position. If you have a guy who can just extend plays with his legs, it's not to say everyone's going to be Lamar Jackson, but it's saying, Hey, this is how football's played now in 2022 to keep defenses honest. 